Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to do a full face tutorial, a flawless face using affordable products that you guys can find at the drugstore. They are products that you've heard about, maybe you have in your collection, and I just wanted to show you that you can get, you can achieve a full face of makeup using affordable drugstore products. I've done one previously. I will link it below in the description box so you guys can check it out. And today I'm gonna repeat that but with um, some new products that I've never tried before. So I have some from CoverGirl, I have Essence. You guys saw my recent videos where I did um, Elf and uh, Black Radiance, just a lot of different products. I will tell you guys what I'm using as I go along. Um, so just sit back, relax, and I wanna thank those of you who are new to my channel. I have some new subscribers. I wanna thank you for joining the family. And for those of you who've been around for a while, thank you as always for supporting me. You guys saw me use this in one of my recent hauls when I did my Five Below. I'm using the 3-in-1 Primer Water by Wet n Wild. For the foundation, I'm actually going to use one that I have not used on camera yet, but it is new to my collection. For the face, I'm using this CoverGirl foundation. This is the Full Spectrum Matte Ambition Foundation, and this is in the shade Deep Neutral. Um, this is looking good. This is looking good. I'm using the 16 hour camo concealer by elf. I have been using this a lot lately And I love it Use a damp sponge and buff it in Who else has kind of like lost the whole concept of time because <laughs> Honestly today feels like it could easily be Sunday night it's Friday night, y'all. I mean, welcome to quarantine because it feels like it is Sunday night. But I did have an amazing like happy hour session on Zoom with my girlfriends. That was fun. I am gonna use the matte setting powder. I use matte everything for obvious reasons. I am super oily. No shame in my game. Dab. And set. I do not want this to crease at all. I'm now gonna go in with the cream blush and I'm gonna use this orangey shade because of what I kind of have going on. I wanna stick with the theme of that. I always go on top of the cream blush with a powder that is similar in color to kind of like set it so I go back into the powder and I will use a similar color I'll use this one just mix the two a little bit and set it it's like a it mixed like for a coral blend I don't know if you guys can see that We have the Sun Club Matte Bronzing Powder Palette by Essence and it looks like this and I really like it. You could use this lighter shade to set underneath the eye and the darker shades to contour. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, let's just use the dark shade. So you guys know I've always used the Anastasia Brow Pomade because it's my absolute favorite. It works. I love it. Um, so this is the LA Girl Brow Pomade in Dark Brown. My first time trying it, so the jury's still out. I am using this Fire Eyeshadow Palette by Essence. Um, it is so pretty. 
this is so cute this reminds me of this reminds me of a juvia's place palette um this reminds me of a morphe palette it's so pretty i love the color story so i'm gonna use those two in the crease this color i'm gonna go back in with the flat angle brush and just apply some of that concealer on top of the lids so I can go in with a different color. I will go in now with, I wanna keep it, I wanna keep the same palette, so I'm gonna go into this lighter shade right here in the corner and just pack that on. I feel like you can achieve any look with any product, honestly. I think the key is all about like application, precision of application and technique. I'm gonna go in this Wet n Wild palette. This is the My Glamour Squad. And I'm gonna use this dark shade for the outer corner. For that type of precision on the outer corner, I will go in with a pencil brush. I just go back in with my blending brush and just kind of like blend everything together. Cause you don't really want like any lines of separation, but you also don't want like the inside that we worked so hard to create. We don't want that to blend outside. So I told you guys that this was gonna be flawless and cheap and it really is. Um, so I love how we're looking here. I am gonna use that same shade though from the Wet n Wild palette and I'm gonna go beneath the lower lash line. Over here. So I'm using the NYX or NYX Matte Liquid Liner. Okay, so I feel like for the most part the wings are fine. I got this Kiss Lash. This is the triple push-up lash. These are the Brazier. They really hug your eyes like a brassiere, you know? Actually, I am using the Igloo by Kiss. All right, so I'm gonna just pop on this lash and get to the other one. That is cute. I have this hashtag lashes of the day by Essence. It is the super volume mascara. So that's what I will be using. For the lip, I will wear Mahogany by NYX. I'll be using the Seriously Satin Lipstick by e.l.f. and this is in the shade Persimmon, Persimmon, I don't know, it's a bright orange, y'all. Okay, it's pretty. And to finish off the look, I will use this highlighter by Black Radiance, it says new. This is in the shade Gilded Glow. It is very pretty inside, I love this like queen African tribute kind of vibe it has imprinted on it. Very cute. And it's very pretty. Very black girl friendly. I'm here for the gilded glow. I am going in this Sunlighter palette. This is the Pure Nude Sunlighter palette by Essence. I'm gonna go in one of the light ones and just pop it in my inner corner. Yeah. 
And just to finish off everything, we have the Instant Matte. Um, this is the makeup setting spray. And it's oil free, non sticking, and lightweight. So, hi right, guys, this is the finished look. I love how it turned out. I use only affordable products, all you can find at the drugstore. And um, they applied beautifully and pretty much performed like any other high end product. So, drugstore makeup can give you a flawless face, a flawless finish and i am loving it so let me know what you guys think about the look and don't forget to like share and subscribe bye bye